Welcome back to my face. My name is Brianna and I'm the head honcho here at Bambi Media. If you've clicked on this video, it means that you're probably a podcaster looking for ways to improve the actual quality of your podcast production. In this video series, you're going to learn how to record and edit using Descript. There'll be a link to download Descript in the description below. And yes, we're an affiliate of theirs because they are awesome. If you prefer to consume this content in order, then you're able to do that by going to bambimedia.com slash DIY podcaster. You'll just need to create an account to be able to log into the back end of that, but it is completely free at no cost to you. If you'd like to work with us here at Bambi Media, there's a bunch of ways to do that. You can head to bambimedia.com and find out more there. All right, let's get into it. Now we're going to create a template out of the intro and outro that you just created so that you can use it every time. We're going to go over from this main dashboard, go back to your main project where you've got your intro and outro, and you're going to go to templates. We go to new template and we're going to call this podcast editor pro. Now, the next thing we're going to do is we're going to grab the intro that we created and we're going to drop it in. Now it's going to transcribe it. That's fine. It can do that if it wants, but we actually don't need it to be transcribed because it's not going to be used in that way. Highlight, click, drag so that it's not on the main timeline. This is the main timeline, the bottom. This is the layer. So the top layer is the theme music. Now layers make sense because what will actually happen is that your audio when you speak will be recorded down here in the main timeline and your theme music will be sitting above it, right? You don't want this to be coming in and normalizing to a small number. So you wanna go up there to audio and go zero dB so that it's exactly the audio level that you recorded it in as. Now this is your intro ready to go. The next thing you're gonna do is you're gonna right click over here, sorry, left click first, then right click, add scene at playhead. Now what you're creating here is another scene. This is the scene for the outro. We're gonna move this over so that it's nowhere near the intro so that you get a really good understanding of the fact that it is not the intro, it is the outro. So I'm just gonna put it over a little bit further so that you can really tell that this is something different. Now you're gonna go back to where you saved your theme and you're gonna to go to outro and you're gonna grab it. And it's going to bring it in and normalize it, which again, we don't want it to do. Make sure that you scroll all the way out so that you click and drag that out and you get the whole thing. And you're gonna go zero dB again so that it is exactly what we want it to be. <laughs> Cool. Okay, so that is the outro. So now we have an intro and an outro. And see how they're named properly too? Outro, intro, so that we understand. Now we're going to save this as our template. So we go publish template and we name our scenes. The first scene is the intro. So podcast editor pro intro, podcast editor pro outro. And we're going to, that's fine, share with Drive, publish template. So that's going to publish, which means now you can access it for your sessions. And this will start to make a whole lot of wonderful sense now that we then go into the next session, which is actually recording your first episode and any subsequent episodes into Descript.